Hello everyone and welcome to another Steam Next Fest demo and in today's video we are checking out a game called Nuclear Sub. Um, it caught my eye because I'm quite a big fan of uh, U-Boat, uh, the game on Steam about running a German World War II submarine through hostile waters and all that kind of stuff. I've also played Cold Waters which is a sort of similar-ish game but set more in modern times in more of the sort of Cold War era um, and also um, I used to play Silent Hunter back in the day as well so this one caught my eye I thought I'd check it out it looks like it's a bit more like U-Boat but maybe a little bit more first person inside the boat but I really don't know a great deal about this I'm just kind of like a lot of Steam Next Fest demos I'm kind of just taking a look at the pictures and videos reading a very brief description of the game and thinking yeah we'll give that a go Oh blimey, this is the full, the full first person. Uh, escape to the harbour, avoid the incoming torpedo by turning and changing depth. Use radial manual Q and change depth to 20 metres. Dive to 20 metres. Turn 90 degrees. Rudder to starboard, 90 degrees. Rudder to starboard. Set the boat speed in control room, the reactor power knob. Okay, this is all a bit uh, frantic straight away. Where's, where's the power knob? Uh, that's that's like torpedo controls. Um, tactical map. Where's the reactor power knob? One minute to impact. Quick, Captain, do something. Okay, we we might die. Oh wait, I can see something's lit up. Something was lit up. Thirteen knots. Is that what you wanted us to do? Use map, move to specified region. All right, we're all the way down here. Right, come on. Report that incident to base. Base, this is USS Nautilus reporting an incident. We were attacked. USS Nautilus, this is base. What is it this time? Another false alarm? Negative, base. We were attacked by a Silvermany class destroyer. A Silvermany? Come on, who put you up to this? Sir, really? I assure you this is not a- This is Commander. I'm taking over the communication. This is not a prank. I repeat, we were attacked by a Silvermany class destroyer with two torpedoes. Commander, you know we can't waste time on- Listen carefully. We have so no way. recordings. The Silvermany fired two torpedoes at us. This is a serious situation. USS Nautilus, understood. I'm informing command. Maintain your course to the harbor in depth. Report if you re-establish enemy contact. Understood, base. We'll report. I... USS Nautilus out. Have you ever heard a conversation like that take place in any... I just... I can't imagine that would ever happen. I had to tell him four times before he took us, uh, took us seriously. I'm assuming this is where we're going, right? It says move to the specified region, and that was where... I mean, yeah. I mean, the ship that was shooting us sort of sure gave up pretty quickly. Just the three FPS. Just the three. Okay, right. I mean, we were heading out to sea. There's no way that was a harbour where we just where we just headed to. It's a big sub. Uh, 
Frozen we Shadow. We are surprised by the Soviet destroyer's reaction. We think this may be due to plans to conduct tests of a new cluster weapon on George Islands. We need to sail there and track the route of the Sovremeni, which is patrolling the area. There are several smaller patrol ships in the vicinity of the islands, but if you keep your submarine underwater, you shouldn't be detected by them. Okay. So we've just run away from the ship that's trying to attack us, and now we're going to go back and start following it. Is this game co-op? I suspect it might be. Set your depth to the periscope depth. Q to open radio diving. Make your depth periscope depth. So one of the charms about say uh, U-boat is that you can kind of zoom in. I think you can even go into first person on U-boat, but you can kind of see the outside as well. So you can see your ship diving, which is a really cool look. Let's go down here and have a look down here, shall we? So here's the uh, steering steering planes. What we got over here? Lots of valves and dials and knobs. Can't even, uh, can't even go in there, uh, or there. Get close to the last known location of the Sovereign Mini. Uh, movement. We can't do... Can we not do speed? No, apparently not. So speed is all done. We're very. Uh, is this the reactor? We're very close to the reactor, aren't we? On the bridge. Okay, right. And also. Okay, fine. So, apparently, even if I select, like, five knots there, let go, 15. 0 0.08, 15. In fact, I can't turn it off. Not much is... Can't press much on here. Is there anything else in here that we can that we can use? I don't think we can. Can't go down there. I mean, are we actually moving? It's so a very odd layout. I will say that. Okay. Look through the periscope. Scan Sovereign by hovering the periscope on it. There it is. Oh, I have to hover over it. Okay. Open map, get to the marked location. This is incredibly, this is like a very elaborate point and click, isn't it, at the moment? been detected have we I mean, where is the marked it wants us to go all the way down here now I'm really not sure what we're doing here
So we got close to the ship, we scanned it, and now we're running away. There's no fucking way that that was the mission. That's embarrassing. That is absolutely embarrassing. So we got in the ship, we drove all the way, we sailed all the way up there, we looked at him through the periscope and then ran away. It was, that was literally the mission. That is incredible. That is absolutely incredible. Reports unusual activity of enemy patrol boats. Yes, sir. I'm not even gonna listen to him. Right, we'll, we'll do this one and just see if it's any different. The problem is, is that the way in which everything is laid out inside the submarine, if you get into a sticky situation, the control layout where some things are done are being done by this. Like, how on earth are you supposed to navigate a, a situation where you're, you know, maybe scrapping with another, um, another boat, and I mean now we're in a completely different theater of war. I just don't get it. I just don't understand what the point of this game is. I mean, I know you win some when you lose some with Steam Next Fest, but I expected this game to have a little bit more to it than this. I mean, it's made by... it's made by Playway, isn't it, I think? Yeah, it's made by Playway SA, so I, I'm, I shouldn't be surprised particularly by the graphics and general just lack of atmosphere and lack of real um, immersion. Although Playway also did um, U-Boat, I think, and that is, you know, a, a, a success story as far as I'm concerned. I cannot tell you how bad this is. My FPS is literally two while fast traveling on this map. This is, at the moment, comfortably one of the worst demos I've ever played. This is in absolutely no way, shape or form, ready to be shown to the public. I guess I'll just wait for another gameplay element that I have absolutely no control of. If this is all I have to do... Destroy it. Okay, well, at least we're going to get into a fight by the sound of it. Right, let's go back to 2 FPS mode. Right, we're here. Anything? Look at this. Look at the detail on those clouds. Look at it. Stunning. It's honestly... Everything about this is so scuff. Alright, I can't... I can't see anybody. Okay, you're over that way, are you? Let's see if we can... Uh, can we see him now? I mean, based on the distance of travel and which direction we're travelling, it should be in front of us. Aha, there it is. Trying to, I'm trying to scan you. We're compromised. Initiate defensive protocols. Okay. Load torpedo to tube one. Load torpedo to tube two. Load torpedo to tube three. Load torpedo to tube four. Oh, okay. I thought I was going to, uh... Torpedo loaded. Okay, well, at least there's some more buttons to press. Um, set the range data. Uh... What did we say it was? 838. 40 is fair enough. Um, bearing is 16 degrees. 
Uh, I can never remember which side is bow, which side is... Oh, there you go, port and starboard. Bow, bow is the rear of the ship, isn't it, I think? Uh, set direction angle from hardboard. So this is the angle on bow, isn't it? This one. Observe the enemy hit through the periscope. There's no fucking way. Did you just hear? Did you hear? That noise. It sounded like someone just dropped a stone in the miss, water. Sir. That is an absolute disgrace. That is an absolute disgrace. All right. Speed 12 knots. That noise is so bad. Where the fuck are they going? Torpedo missed, sir. I, I, I did. I, what did I do wrong? I mean, he's literally not moving. Oh, he is moving. He certainly doesn't look like he's moving there. It looks like he stopped. Do two this time. Right, range. 430. Bearing. 32. Direction angle. 129. Speed. Ship speed, targets. Target speed is 12. Everything is plugged in. I don't understand. Torpedo missed, sir. Can someone please explain to me? I mean, he looks more like that, if I'm being brutally honest. Let me see if I can eyeball this one. He looks more like he's at about almost 90 degrees to us. Bearing from us towards the enemy, and again, I would say it's more like that right now. I mean, where's the, where's the map? Yeah, I mean, he's, it looks like he's virtually 90 degrees to us. I'll put, I'll put it about there. Range, he's, he's not moved, he's still about 430. We'll go slightly more, we'll go 450. Right, load those. When you're quite ready, chaps. Okay, they look like a bit more on target. Torpedo missed, sir. Right, okay. We were closer. I'm not sure he would normally give us this much time to keep getting this right. Right, we'll go a bit more like like there, I reckon. Twenty two. Direction angle. Do that. Range is about right. It's a good thing we appear to have many, many torpedoes on board. Fuck, where's the ship gone? Torpedo loaded. Gently drop the torpedoes in the water, please, and send them away. Torpedo missed, sir. Oh, I'd say that must have been close. Just so you know, this video will continue until I hit this shot. Come on. This is the one. This is the one. I can feel it. Torpedo Fire. loaded. Oh, fucking hell. Okay, that's as, that's as bad as it's ever been. Torpedo missed, sir. Right, this is the one. This is the one. I can feel it. Torpedo Fire. 
Oh, okay. That's looking promising. Hit, Yay! Finally, we did it. It only took only taken us. What? How many? How many torpedoes did that take us? Fifteen hours later. Locate the ship. Oh, have I got? A, have I got to sink another one? Oh, I don't know if I want to do another one. I mean, at this point, I'm carrying on with the game just through curiosity. Not because I'm having a great time or because, you know, I'm keen to see how this game ends. I know, I know, I know how this game is going to end. God, this guy is facing us front on as well. This is a horrendous attack. Oh, and he sh is he shooting at us? Oh. Activate the yellow alarm. Uh oh. What the fuck are these things they're firing at us? What am I witnessing? Was that some kind of, um, sometimes they use like, um, like not flares, but like markers, don't they? So they can determine a distance on something, but nothing I've ever witnessed in any documentary or film. I'm pretty sure that he's meant to be a torpedo. I mean, or is it? No, it's just. Or is it just a? Is it just a shell? I mean, they're literally. I mean, this is okay. Right, this is a sign. This is quite possibly the worst game I've ever played. Oh my god, this game is dreadful. I mean, you, you, as you say, you win some and you lose some with Steam Next Fest, but that is a travesty of a game. That might be one of the worst games I've ever played. <laughs> It's so bad. It's actually humorous. It's it's funny how bad that was. Oh, good lord. Well, as I said, you win some, you lose some. We experienced it. We've been here. We gave it a go. We gave it our all. But, yeah, they, I literally have nothing good to say about this game. There is not one single redeeming quality of nuclear sub on Steam. Steer well well clear of this game complete the game survey survey sorry i'm not sure you want me to do that i'll be honest so anyway i am going to um i'm going to leave this one here thank you very much for watching i hope you've uh, stayed until the end and endured this with me serve my pain with me um make sure you like the video make sure you comment down below what did you think of this game was it as bad as, as it looked <laughs> um, I'm not even going to recommend you go and try it just for the funsies because it's not uh, don't forget to sub, don't forget to uh, ring the notification bell and all that good stuff and I'll see you all on the next Team Next Fest video and here's praying that it's better than this one